Hello and welcome back to Until Dawn. This is Jason the Human and we are with Mike who, after just getting the fire going and having a nice conversation with Jessica, she got yanked out of the window and we went to try to find out what's going on and figure out where she was at. We did some chasing and yeah, we made some wrong decisions apparently or whatever, but she got dropped down an elevator shaft and her jaw was missing. So we lost our first person. Uh, so we're, we found out our gun only had so many bullets and they're gone. So we got a lantern and we're continuing the chase to try to figure out what's going on. So get some revenge here. So let's see what happens, shall we? Peter Storm Air also asks us who we like the most and and who we like the least, and we picked Mike as who we like the least. Jesus. What the fuck is that place? Jessica probably end up more in the middle. I don't know how much bearing that has on who you get to be and win. Here's Chris waking up. They got attacked by someone. After they found out about Ashley? a threat to the Washington family, Ashley got taken and he got knocked out. And someone set up some sort of little thing. There's a little black balloon Ash. with an arrow pointing towards something. We have to try to figure out what that's all about. Oh. Not good. Not good at all. <laughs> oh shit. No. Let's take a closer look and move my light around. I don't know if it No, I don't necessarily see anything. All right. Two paths. Blood goes this way, so we're following that. Dumb as that might be. Oh! Hey, the scarecrow. That we said we scared us. Another totem. Somebody hanging off something. It's a death totem. The possible death of the person who finds it. Sometime after the prospectors came to mine this mountain, until a cave in. I might hold off on watching some of those until I get a little more to go off of. Apparently I don't go down that path. 
There's gotta be a way somewhere, right? Oh. Oh shit. Pig's head. Dumped on the mountain. It's fresh and there's blood splattered all over it. Okay. Make sure they weren't trying to lead me to look at something. Ash. 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 Ashley. <laughs> okay, good. I reset. Kind of towards towards the front. That was bugging me. She said that because that thing uh, fell. Uh, I'm coming, Ash. Just, uh, just keep talking to me. What happened? Oh, choices. Oh Chris, no. Are you there? Hello. And thank you all for joining me tonight. We're going to do just there, so experiment, sort of test. Now, for this experiment, we'll need the cooperation of our two test subjects, Joshua. And Ashley. Oh my God. But we're gonna need one more brave participant to help decide which subject will live and which will die. Oh, no. oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! Chris, oh, get us out of here! Please, from here. You made please, it. please, everyone, calm down. It's all very simple. Christopher, you will find a lever placed directly in front of you. All you have to do is choose who you will save. Okay, 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 this is gonna be okay. Oh, oh, dude, buddy, oh let's just God. think about this for Griff, a minute. You can't let me die. Just give me a second, I, 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 uh, huh? I can't think straight. Just... Huh? Ashley, I'll get you out of this. I won't let you die. Oh, shit. Oh, thank you. Please, no. I shouldn't have done anything. They say sometimes not making the decision is the right thing. But it's going, so. I, I, I don't know what to do. No! Bro, we've been through so much. Come on, I don't want to go out like this. What if I don't make a decision? Does it just go straight? I don't know. I feel like maybe what if I don't make the decision? What if, or do they both? I see. You have chosen to save Ashley. No, Chris! Oh, no, I made a decision. Oh, it's like he did it on his own. Why would you do this? He didn't pull the lever, though. Hmm. Well, no, 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 Dad, don't, don't, don't look, Ashley. Why don't can't look. I look? Chris, please tell me he's okay, please. Oh. I'm coming, Ash. I'm, I'm gonna get you down. I'm letting you down. Shh, shh, stop, please. Come on, come on, let's, let's, let's get you down. Come on, we're gonna get you down. I probably shouldn't have made a decision at all. And what would have happened? Probably both of them would have got killed, but it's hard to say. Whoa. Ashley! 
God, whose butt is that, Josh, Ash? Are you okay? Chris, what happened? Josh! Josh, what? Dude? He said... Wait, not what? right in front of us, man. What are you there's, talking there's about? There's a maniac. Maniac? Oh my God, we gotta get out of here. I don't understand what happened. There's a maniac, and he was there was a sign. It was either him or Ash, and I, I don't know what oh to God. do. And it come right through my head, spilling out fucking everywhere. What? Oh my God, Chris! What? And I, I killed him. What, Chris? I, I killed him. It was my fault, man. No, no, this is insane. We need to go get some help. We go right in hell. We're gonna figure this out. <laughs> Matt, we need to go get help now. And we should look for the others. Mike and Jess are off 69ing each other, and who knows where Sam is. I think she's in the lodge. Fine. Fine, you're right. Get everyone else together, but if there's a maniac running around, I think we need to get some help, too, right? Not just wait around. But what about... Why are we still talking about this? Let's go! Smart. Get everyone together. Considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Could he be hiding there? Dread. Six hours until dawn. That's where we follow the guy too, so. Damn it. Okay, so there was an opportunity to he was petting one of the one of the dogs. Let's get a closer look. So we'll keep that in mind. Whether for food or 
whatever. Well, I assume food, because I assume they're decently trained. But. It actually opens. Kind of surprised. Okay. Clocking in cards. Oh, from the mine. 30 miners were trapped in the mine. See if there's anything else of interest in here before we head out. Camera. It's just broken. The lens of the camera is smashed. It looks like someone did this on purpose. Assaulted. 1952. A reporter was banned from visiting a group of rescued miners. A reporter had, the, had his camera confiscated. A reporter from the Alberta Bugle was assaulted and hospitalized yesterday by security personnel at the Blackwood Sanatorium. 
Chuck Bernstein, a senior news reporter, was seeking an interview with the miners dramatically rescued on Tuesday. The men had been trapped underground for over three weeks after a structural collapse. Okay. And they said, yeah, from what I've seen of the videos from getting the, the little uh, totems, it seems like they went a little crazy and attacked each other. So, or attacked someone. I assume each other, and yeah, um, so person, this person got a little too close and got attacked. Jefferson Bragg, sole proprietor of both the Northwest Mining Company and the Blackwood Sanatorium, told The Bugle yesterday that the incident was unfortunate and that a full internal inquiry had been launched. He also claimed that Pernstein had been trespassing on sanatorium grounds without permission. They just believe the assault arose from an argument about Bernstein's camera, which was confiscated immediately. So he was trying to take pictures of whatever was going on, and they didn't take kindly to that, apparently. But yeah, definitely, like, it's... I assume, yeah, they should not have been in there antagonizing the people because something happened, but... It seems like the sanatorium people had... It seemed like they reacted hard against the... The reporter, so it seems a little unnecessary, but I don't know. Is there another path in here? Or is that all? Because all right, that's going to be this episode. So uh, mysterious things going on in here. We will find out what more about that potentially next time and see if the wolf or whatever whatever premonition we had if we can figure out what opportunity we have to to make friends with one of them it seemed like so more on that next time thank you so much for watching we'll be playing until dawn this has been jason the human